Final data confirmed on Monday that Italy is in a recession, which underscores the difficulties facing Mario Monti's technocratic government as it grapples with a shrinking economy dragged down by austerity measures and a debt crisis. Italy's economy shrank 0.7% in the fourth quarter of 2011, following a 0.2% decline in GDP in the third quarter. Monti, who rushed through a 33 billion euro austerity plan in December and is now working on reforms to boost growth, is due to meet Germany's Chancellor Angela Merkel on Tuesday for talks in Rome. Germany's economy contracted by 0.2% in the fourth quarter, but analysts are expecting Europe's largest economy to pick up steam again this year, while Italy is seen lagging. Weak consumption in the Eurozone's third largest economy weighed heavily in the fourth quarter, while investments and inventories also declined, but net exports contributed positively. Italy's National Statistics Office, ISTAT, said GDP fell 0.4% year-on-year in the fourth quarter, revising a preliminary estimate of a 0.5% fall. Monti's austerity measures, including spending cuts, tax hikes, and pension reform, are aimed at balancing the budget in 2013. The critics say they will weigh on Italy's already chronically low growth rates. Market concerns about the sustainability of the country's 1.9 trillion euro public debt have calmed since Monti replaced Silvio Berlusconi in November, and yields on Italy's 10-year bonds have fallen to below 5%, from peaks close to 8% at the end of 2011. Monti is now working on measures to stimulate the economy, and his government is due to meet with unions and employers on Monday to discuss a labor market reform to follow deregulation measures announced in January. Jessica Minton, IB Times TV.